Oh! Oh, hello there! Are you here to watch Down May Cry? Well, just in luck, people. Time for episode 10 bad news. Oh, sugar balls. In, ep in mission 9. Ooh. Why, Mr. Finney? What happened to him? It was Phineas. I want to see Mundus destroyed. And I now believe you may stand a chance. Holy you balls. Your mind. You were right. You're not just like your father. I see your mother in you too. <gasps> Eva the whore. You want to hit Mundus hard? This is how. Mundus has power almost beyond limit. But he has one weakness. They always have a weakness. He has a weakness. It's scrotum. Yes. Oh. His mistress, Lilith. His weakness is that he loves her? <laughs> Demons don't love what you want about. Mundus? Love? No, my friend. It's his heart. Yet, she has recently become the most important thing in creation to him. This is what I have seen. Lilith, <gasps> his mistress. Carries his child, his heir. You want to hurt Mundus? Shit. Kill Lilith. Kill the child. He thinks like a demon. Nothing will hurt him more. No wonder in all the uh, predecessors of the Devil May Cry game. The fury of Mundus oh. is boundless. That Mundo Mundus absolutely hates Dante. Finish. Ooh, apparently I'm his master now. Good old Mr. Finney Fantastic has decided to uh, help me and aid me on my quest of killing demons. And I'm upside down. Because this ain't weird at all, is it? Oh, God. This even makes me feel weird on the inside. Can I not have like a Mobius ring track and just flip this thing right around? I guess not. Mr. Bobby Parker, we're coming for you. Oh shit, I've been seen. The Eye of Sauron is not pleased. Holy balls. Oh, there you go, it's flipped over now. I'll just use my uh, blue grappling chain then. Good. I finally have your attention. Says no one ever. <laughs> Wee! You've got to be kidding me! Jesus! Oh wow! I generally thought I got hit then. Yay! Mr. Finny Fantastic can't help me now! Bloody balls, Sacasaurus! Oh! Let's see what Mr. Bobby Barker has to say about this. Hi, I'm Bob Barker. Welcome to Raptor News. Oh God! Oh, here he is, <laughs> looking all smug. Oh, those blue grappling things. Are oh, I'm in the. Am I in the news network? What the smeg? Okay, this uh, slightly weird. Is this what it's like to work in the BBC? This is some scary shit. Let's have a look. Let's see what I can do. Where are you, Bobby B? Oh god! I feel like I'm in some sort of virtual reality. And Bobby Barker's actually just playing like Pac Man with me. Oh my Jesus. This is 
Is this the real Bob Barbus? Yes, it is. How you doing, friend? Hey, Bob. Put a spin on this. <laughs> My personal view. I love his humor. Is that they are disgusting, degrading, ghastly, sleazy, purient, and generally nauseating. The worst of them. Just like your comb over. The whole world <laughs> would benefit greatly by his non-existence. I'm taking you off the air. You think so? I wouldn't bet on it, you little shit. <laughs> oh, sh what the? Oh, this reminds me of a boss that's already existed. Oh, I see what I'm meant to jump through. I'll just use my guns then. Whoa, the... Hold the phone! Ah! I see. No. Oh, the cut! Wow. You're not looking happy, Bobby B. Good thing I upgraded my sword. Oh, wrong way. What's the blue? I really took a bloody beating then. Okay, let's grapple his goddamn eyes. You think you're some kind of big brother system? Oh my god, what is happening? Oh, I saw the footage of me. Oh wow, I get to control this. Hook smash! So what do we know about this guy? Several people have now come forward and investigators have pieced together a shocking history of violence. At age eight, he attacked and killed the head nurse at St. Lamia Orphan. Did I? She was described as a sweet old lady who particularly enjoyed working with children. Between the ages of 11 and 15, he broke out of no less than eight youth detention facilities, often mounting brutal, humiliating... It's really hard to pay attention to what the Smeggy is saying when I'm... ...just doing their jobs. Between 16 and 17, he became involved in gangs, drug peddling. No, he didn't. What are you on about? For over a dozen homicides. And worst of all, he was also a well known cruiser in the seedier districts of the city. <laughs> Rampantly spread. Oh, god damn it, Dante. Of the unholy kind. And ain't that the best kind, Bob? Oh. I wanted to kill him then. Oh. Oh wow. You're really going ape shit, ain't you? Oh, the beams are getting thicker. Oh, wow, this one is. Totally worth it. Oh, smooth! Like a recently waxed lady's leg. Let's do this. Right. Dante is involved in the terrorist organization called the 
Order. I have a message for the Order. The whole world is looking for you. Every camera, on every street corner, every police force in the country and worldwide. But we will find you. We will destroy you. It's only a matter of time. This is Bob Barbus of the Raptor News Network. Just doing God's work. I won't get hit. Oh! Dude, doing it pro since 1990. Good old Devil May Cry. I interrupt this broadcast to bring you breaking news. Let's have a look. The terrorist organization responsible for the recent attacks has been located and is being stormed by SWAT teams no. as I speak. Oh, shit. See you later, cat. Two of the terrorists nice identified you. in these images are known to be in the compound. Bastards. See, they've got a picture of a hood down. Took me goddamn nine episodes. City in a separate police raid. Rest assured, those responsible will be brought to justice at any moment. Dead or alive. This is Bob Barbus of the Raptor News Network. Just do God's work. Just doing God's work. You goddamn oh. asshole. That scream is hideous. I do think I'm cool. I'm hella cool. Take it in the face like a champ. Breaking news, Bob. You're fired. <laughs> oh, it actually worked. So is that his real body and he's projecting in limbo, or is the real body in limbo and he's projecting into the real world? Oh. Oh, what is this? A new angel weapon. All for the two glaives. Jesus, tit balls. Oh, I'm gonna slice some shit up with these, man. Bye, Bobby B. I liked your program. I love you. I miss you. Oh, there's a casino there. Make your next move, if you will. You've already lost. Oh, don't say that, huh? He's got cars and Aquila! Lightning fast dual weapons. Their long range and sweeping attacks make them devastating against large groups of weak enemies. Cool. Ah! Oh. End of the episode. Bloody got the stylish achievement. I'm 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 not gonna fault myself. That was superb. Ten out of ten. Only took six minutes apparently. Jesus, that was perfectly good. Oh. Look at all these S's. Oh. Oh triple S. Oh. I'm so proud of myself. And that's the end of the episode, obviously. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me a dislike. But if you didn't, I'd like to I'd like to know why. Give me a little comment and be like, oh Josh, it's because you uh, you smell like a rancid hobo. And I'll be like, oh dude, there are some hobos who actually smell better than me, so please don't associate them with me. It's it's harsh for them. And uh, you know, on that note, have a good day. If you're new to this, please subscribe. You know, help me grow. And uh, have a nice day. Hope you all have a good day. See you later, dudes.